The Presidential Task Force on COVID-19 has asked Nigerians to minimize the risk of coronavirus COVID-19 infection in the country. Dr. Sani Aliu, National Coordinator of the PTF, made the call in Abuja at the Joint National Briefing of PTF on COVID-19. Aliu called for the protection of young people, especially as schools have resumed after months of shutdown occasioned by COVID-19 pandemic outbreak in the country. Regarding the reopening of schools, he said it has to be gradual but added that all stakeholders must be wary of contracting COVID-19 and should strictly adhere to the public health advisories. We must also take responsibility to minimize the risk of transmission, protect our young people and their families for the schools to be able to operate effectively. Each of us has their own part to play. It is definitely time for Nigeria to get moving and in this regard we have to support our students and we also have to protect our schools because by protecting our schools and educational system we also protect our future. Both the NCDC, the Federal Ministry of Education, PTF and state authorities have been working very closely to make sure that the guidelines we produce are relevant to our setting and will also enable us to continue on the right track of um, keeping on top of the pandemic. Um, we always said schools should open in a staggered way. So we expect school authorities and state governments to, to decide on that. The PTF will not be making a statement to say nurseries should remain closed, other, other primary schools should open or universities should open, but secondary schools should remain closed. That's a decision of the state authorities. All we are saying is, here are the guidelines. We want it to be staggered. We want you to do things in a proper way. Here are the um, interventions that we expect, etc. and please follow them. But it's a decision of state authorities. It's not the PTF's decision. Uh, we've had further conversations with NYC. We've actually given them a date, but the announcement of that date remains the responsibility of the NYC. Thank you.